It's for the wicked. Right, so it doesn't matter how much ganja you smoke, uh, you're not going to find the rest of God because it's not there for you. You're a psychopath. But I sleep damn well. You said no rest for the wicked. Well, for now. We'll see, we'll see that in a thousand years. We'll, we'll do a follow-up interview with you in a thousand years and see how you sleep in. The Bible says, Fret not thyself for the wicked that perish for a, that, that prosper for a moment, for they'll be cut down like grass. Yeah, so you might sleep all right now. Oh, yeah. But you know how much booze you have to drink till you accomplish that, you know. A couple of bottles, that's right. See, so you're not sleeping good. I don't need to drink a couple of bottles. I sleep fine every night. Yes, sir, young man over there. Violent, non-violent. Well, the bottom line is, uh, when I was a child, I did childish things. When I became a man, I put away the, the kid stuff and became a man. So if you're 20-something, it's time to start considering the time that you have. You don't have a lot of time. It's time to do something worthwhile, and uh, call to duty is not uh, worthwhile. You're never going to prosper in your life because you got a, a high score on a video game. Well, chess can make your mind think and help you uh, formulate strategies. And some of those games might do that. Well, if you're if you're, I'll, I'll give you that exception. If you're if you're planning to go into the military, then maybe, uh, or if you want to be a flight, if you're in flight school, maybe a a, a simulate a flight simulator might be different. But I wouldn't call that a game at that point. There's a difference between sitting on a couch eating Cheetos and playing games and actually trying to train for uh, special ops in the military.